do everything with all the lights turned off. So it's very, <laughs> it's very hard to get good video of thermostats. The second thing that uh, that we have really embraced in the in the core design philosophy is to get users' jobs done faster. And that goes beyond just turning up the speed. And you'll see some amazing things that we've done just with core speed in the product. But quite frankly, that is a tiny fraction of what a user does. Right, now, it's nice to know that you can open up a large assembly or a large drawing in a fraction of the time. In fact, it's going to have a big impact on a lot of our customers who are used to trying to open a large assembly and then they go get a cup of coffee, check the sports scores, and then come back, and by then it's typically open. We're going to disrupt that for their, for their lives from now on. But that being said, it's also important that the actual design get out the door faster. And so engineering software has to complement the overall design process. Dare we try to look at customer Fender? We'll try. Fender guitars. OK. So Fender Guitars also is operating in the dark. This is, this is their factory. <laughs> they are a green company also. I'm sure if uh, Leo Fender had some solutions, he would have used it. But uh, it started out as a pretty much a garage shop. They would use shavers to create the neck back shape and create the, the beginning fretboard radius. And when they were finished, they just have to sand everything into the shape that they want. SolidWorks enables us to take many of our manual operations and put them on the CNC to take handling away so that there's less chance of damaging the material. It allows us to see what our contours are going to look like before we attempt to machine them. We don't have to guess what the things are going to look like. You can see right there on the screen. And in the past two years, I've been designing, uh, redesigning, and uh, developing manufacturing processes for a Jackson guitar within Fender. And they're a completely different type of guitar. Uh, Fender guitars are actually relatively simple to make since most everything is flat. With Jackson, I had to go to 3D. There's no way of developing fixtures on the angles in the two-dimensional world. We're developing the process, the SolidWorks model, as if we were machining from raw wood. Okay, I start out with a blank, with a rectangular blank, and we build it up in SolidWorks as we're going to manufacture it. It makes it easier to see how our, our product fits on our, on our tooling plates. I see if it's going to interfere with anything. Our custom shop people have been saying that these are, the necks have been coming out better than they've seen come out of the CNC's ever. And we're getting to the point now where we only leave about 10 thousandths on the back sheet right off the machine, and they just do a quick cleanup of uh, machine marks, and they're done. Anytime you can cut your setup time, you're saving lots of money. So, we're pushing the issue for all of our facilities to be SolidWorks users. So we can transfer information from Mexico to California to Tacoma, Washington, to uh, any of our facilities around the world. So that's Fender. So why don't we take another look at Thermos Paws and their message on focusing on design and not just CAD. I didn't like that video anyway. <laughs> All right, let's talk about improving the quality of designs. I talked earlier about quality, and this is a relentless pursuit that all of our customers have, and our product needs to make it easier to get the product out the door as customers expect. And that's why having integrated analysis tools are so essential. Let's talk to customer EFI and how they're improving the quality of their designs with SolidWorks. EFI is the parent company in Tokyo. Probably the world's best known product for rehab. As well as you've seen all over the infomercials on television. Very, very functional products, but they're not very glamorous. And that was what they 
company was looking for, to go into this new market in a health club where they want to be on a, a product that sizzles. And uh, SolidWorks enabled me to first model up the design the way that uh, it, that it's been proven to work, and then enhance it, make the uh, shapes of the parts more elegant and uh, more interesting and impressive. Time to market is, is really key to our products. The trends of the industry and the styles of the industry drive the direction of what uh, clubs would be buying, and that's the nature of what we have to work with. So the time to market of SolidWorks has given me the ability to produce some phenomenal shapes and uh, different folding linkages and different features that are new and uh, uh, we have then the ability to send them offshore and get them built in a short lead time. SolidWorks has given me the tools, which is the average guy, to be able to take and create some phenomenally interesting shapes, three-dimensional shapes that I can then take to a molder and have them make and uh, everything fit the first time. What I've been able to provide for them is exactly what they've been looking for. They couldn't get the product any other way. SolidWorks has given me the tools to be able to create any 3D surface you want in any place you want and uh, do it with just about any material you want in a short amount of time. So that's EFI Sports, and they're a relatively new user. For those of you who have trouble sleeping at night and you turn on the TV, you're going to start seeing lots of infomercials. Well, probably after the election, since all we're going to get in the U.S. for the next two months is non-stop political ads. But after our lives return to normal, they're going to really attack the, the marketplace with this. And in no time, all of us will be really buff and, and polished and, and ready for the beach for next year. We've also expanded our product lines. If you're serious about listening to your customers, you're willing to make changes in your core products, but you're also willing to add additional products. And of course, it all started with SolidWorks Standard, and we built professional and premium in the, in the following years. And in the case of premium, we now have ECAD integration. And we'll continue to invest in those core products. This year is no different, and you'll see a lot in SolidWorks 2009. But we've also put a significant emphasis in additional products that our customers need to get their, business, their products out the door more quickly. SolidWorks Simulation and the Cosmos products are the most tightly integrated set of analysis tools in the market, period. It allows the designer in stream to refine and test and find alternative merit materials that may reduce the product cost while not impacting the customer experience. It's growing in excess of 30% a year, one of our fastest growing products. And we've really been able to see that you can take analysis mainstream. And SolidWorks Enterprise PDM, many years ago, our customers simply were outgrowing and outreaching the limits of our core PDM product. And we needed an enterprise level data management solution that allowed them to share designs around the world no matter how large or how complex. That also has turned into a very large business for us, growing very quickly. What's really encouraging about the PDM products is larger customers are signing up for this than we had expected. When we built our business model, we had hoped that we would see customers in the 10 to 20 seat range adopting this. But the average is in excess of 50 seats, and we have customers deploying over 500 seats around the world in very, very complex environments. So it was obvious that, that listening to what our customers needed has led to a, a response in kind in their investment. And then the newest product in the family, 3D Via Composer. You know, as great as products get designed, if you cannot communicate those designs to customers and potential customers, if you cannot communicate those to the field service force that has 